Nothing to report. Inquisition wants to field a decent cavalry. It needs better horses. I heard Seeker Pentacar might try to acquire suitable mounts from Master Dennett in the hinterlands. What the higher ups are doing? Back in Ansberg, my uncle was fifth praetor. And what's that mean for you back in Ansberg? Honestly, about as much as it does here. Another time. Another time, then. Expected you'd be by. I'm Hallett, and everyone knows who you are. How's the new gear fit? Sturdy and warm. It's perfect. Good. World's gone mad. Stock armor and blades are good against bandits, but we're not fighting bandits. My gear will see you through demons, apostates, whatever this world throws at you. So. You need custom work, something special. You bring the materials to us, we'll make it happen. If I want something, what can you make? Start simple, something to keep you safe. Take a look at it on the table there and we can talk. You'll need materials. We should have what you want just outside. Can you help improve my arms and armor? Yes. If you find a new piece, a pauldron or greaves, we'll take care of you. You can't just slap a new ill on your sword in the field. Bring it here, we'll make sure it's done right and proper. Goodbye. Right. Kind killed the most holy. Lies. Your kind let her die. Shut your mouth, mate! Enough! Knight Captain! That is not my title. We are not Templars any longer. We are all part of the Inquisition. 
And what does that mean, exactly? Back already, Chancellor. Haven't you done enough? I'm curious, Commander, as to how your Inquisition and its Herald will restore order as you've promised. Of course you are. Back to your duties, all of you. Mages and Templars were already at war. Now they're blaming each other for the Divine's death. Which is why we require a proper authority to guide them back to order. Who? You? Random clerics who weren't important enough to be at the Conclave. The Rebel Inquisition and its so-called Herald of Andraste? I think not. So far, you're the only one who's insisted we can't work together. We might, if your Inquisition would recognize the Chantra's authority. There is no authority until another Divine is chosen. In due time, Andraste will be our guide, not some dazed wanderer on a mountainside. I'll make sure they see reason in Val Royo. I pray you're right. There was no word for heaven or for earth, for sea or sky. All the Researcher Minave wishes to verify that the infections have then decreased the in number. Of the maker yes. Rang out. Thank you for your help. Word. Tell me, and his word. are you happy this way? You were saying something about... Colin? Hmm? I... yes. Haven has limited space for our soldiers to train. Perhaps we could set up something over here. Greetings, Herald of Andraste. How fares your quest to seal the breach? I'm doing everything within my power. A task such as closing the breach is a heavy burden. I hope you do not carry it alone. We remember Andraste, but Andraste did not carry the Chant of Light alone. She had generals, advisors, even her husband for a time. Do everything within your power, but remember those who would help you. You keep talking as though I'm the equal of Andraste. Do you know how unnerving that is? I can only imagine. But we are all given to our purpose under the Maker. A sword does not ask to be forged. And frankly, if such a comparison gives you pause, I do not see that as a bad thing. In any case, I pray this Inquisition proves less brutal than its predecessor. Is there anything I can do to help you or your people? My healers would benefit from more supplies. We have run short of even common goods with so many wounded. If you could deliver this list and the items on it to Quartermaster Thren, 
She could get us what we need. It may not seem like much, but it would enable my healers to save many lives. Farewell. Make her go with you. All men are the work of the Maker's hands. From the lowest slaves to the highest king. Look who's back from the dead. Again. I don't recall meeting you before. I'd be surprised if you did. You weren't particularly coherent. Someone had to patch you up after you staggered out of making those wear, though. So, you're welcome. I didn't realize. Thank you. Yeah. Well... You can pay me back by fixing the world. Name's Adan. I'm in charge of keeping our little band here stocked with potions and elixirs. Not that Seeker Pentagast seems to care whether we've got the supplies to actually do that. How do I go about having potions made? Just take a look there and tell me what you'd like. Find a recipe for something better, I can make that too. The Inquisition cannot remain ambassador if you can't prove it was founded on Justinia's orders. This is an inopportune time, Marquis. More of the faithful flock here each day. But allow me to introduce you to the brave soul who risked his life to slow the magic of the bridge. Sir Trevelyan, may I present the Marquis Durelion, one of Divine Justinia's greatest supporters. And the rightful owner of Haven. How does Durelion lend Justinia these lands for pilgrimage? This Inquisition is not a beneficiary of this arrangement. Interesting, considering the Inquisition was begun by the left and right hands of the Divine. I've seen no written records from Sister Liliana or Seeker Pentacus that Justinia approved the Inquisition. 
If he won't take her at her word, I'm afraid Seeker Pentagast must challenge him to a duel. What? It is a matter of honor among the Navarans. Shall I arrange the bout for tonight? No. No. Perhaps my reaction to the Inquisition's presence was somewhat hasty. <sighs> we face a dark time, Your Grace. Divine Justinia would not want her passing to divide us. She would, in fact, trust us to forge new alliances to the benefit of all, no matter how strange they might seem. I'll think on it, Lady Montilier. The Inquisition might stay in the meanwhile. I'm so pleased the Marquis isn't tossing us out into the cold. His Grace is only the first of many dignitaries we must contend with. You expect more people in Haven? Undoubtedly. And each visitor will spread the story of the Inquisition after they depart. An ambassador should ensure the tale is as complimentary as possible. The Inquisition is lucky to have you as an advocate, Lady Montilier. Thank you. Let us hope so. Thedas's politics have become agitated as of late. I hope to guide us down smoother paths. But please excuse me. I've much work to do before the day is done. You're the Herald. Or, well, the one they're calling the Herald, anyway. I hope the Inquisition can restore order soon. I never really wanted to leave the Circle. My name is Maneve. I research demons and other creatures. Seeker, Pentagast, and I use what I find to help the soldiers fight them. You said you were a mage? No, just an apprentice. I was never very good at magic. I've got just enough talent to be a danger to other people. But when the mages rebelled, people like me had nowhere to go. The Templars would have killed us. Luckily, Seeker Pentagast took me in. Along with the Tranquil, I was protected. I found something the demons left behind. Can you use it? Yes, that's very helpful. Just leave it there and the Tranquil and I will examine it. Hello? Can I help you with something? You said Cassandra has you researching creatures. Yes. If you find anything interesting in your travels, I'd appreciate you bringing it to me. I may be able to find some weakness our soldiers can exploit when fighting various creatures. But at the least, some materials are useful for making potions or gear for the Inquisition. I'll speak with you later. Travel safely. A learned child is a blessing upon your parents and onto the mate. I think the mages will be able to seal the breach. I heard some speak of using the Templars instead. Oh. I suppose that would work as well. No, my lord, I don't know where the other nobles are. I suggest you ask Ambassador Montillier. Oh, you're him. Thren, Inquisition Quartermaster. I'm doing what I can to supply this mess. If you find what I need to fill one of my requisitions, I'd appreciate you bringing it in. If I have material for a special order, do I bring it to you? Just take it over there. One of my boys will take the materials or jot down what you found. What did you mean when you mentioned requisitions? I'm making this Inquisition run with what we have, but we're not a real army. We're stretched thin on materials, so I've put up a requisition list for anything that could help our people. Here, take a look. You find some iron and a good logging site, maybe Harriet can get our troops better weapons.
What do you do here? I make sure the Inquisition troops have food in their bellies and iron in their hands. Both are important. Lots of people expecting us to be heroes, marching all day to fight the demons. Turns out heroes need to dig latrines just like everyone else. Farewell. Make a go with you.